For this round of Arts Activate, Prison Movement Theatre is so excited to be able to provide to a community that we've always wanted to serve, the deaf and hard of hearing audiences. For this project, Prison Movement Theatre is going to collaborate with local deaf communities to create a one-of-a-kind free variety show that specifically caters to deaf and hard of hearing audiences. These performances will be paired with 30-minute workshops that on the basics of American Sign Language that will be designed to teach our non-deaf audiences essential vocabulary before each performance, because this show is going to be specifically designed with deaf audiences in mind. That means we're going to have ASL interpreters there, and most of the show, if it utilizes a form of language, will utilize ASL. This variety show performance is also going to consist of a unique mix of local acts tailored for the deaf and hard of hearing communities to enjoy. This is going to include wordless clowning sequences, uh, comedians and hosts that know ASL, and cultural dance performances with a strong focus on rhythm and stomping, like folklorico and Aztec dancing. We also, during these performances, intend to invest in the accessibility of them by providing ASL interpreters for each event, as well as specialty speakers that will be able to highlight the base of music that we're utilizing so that deaf performers can feel that music through their feet. And our deaf audiences will also be able to feel that music through their feet as well. The best part is we're going to be specifically looking through these deaf communities and partnering with them to help add performances to these variety shows. So it won't just be local Dallas talent that's already established. We're also going to be looking for new talent within these deaf communities and incorporating them within these shows in order to create a more seamless experience. Overall, the show should feel like a high quality variety show that is able to go into each of these unique gathering centers and provide a show that specifically caters to each of these audiences. These performances will tour across the Dallas Metroplex. The performances and workshop pairings will occur once per weekend for three weeks for a total of three performances slash workshops. These performances and workshops will happen in May or June of 2024. A few organizations we're anticipating to be partnering with on this project include Deaf Seniors of the Dallas-Fort Worth Metroplex, Dallas Associate of Deaf Incorporated, Deaf Night Out, and The Penguin Project. We think that Prison Movement Theater is an organization that is perfectly positioned to serve the deaf and hard of hearing audiences because of our history as a wordless movement theater company. We emphasize the beauty of movement arts, so it only makes sense for us to refocus our efforts in working with our local deaf and hard of hearing communities on this project. We are fortunate enough to have developed the outreach services and network necessary to reach deaf and hard of hearing audiences over the years. And our plan to reach these audiences is to approach figureheads within these communities and let them know that we are out to serve them, that we want to collaborate with them to create this unique show that is specifically designed for them to enjoy. To make this project happen, we're gonna be working together with a number of wonderful creatives. We have Marianne Galloway, who will be serving as one of our producers. She is a hard of hearing actress and director who has been in the Dallas-Fort Worth community for a number of years. Her advocacy towards accessibility in the arts has been long standing and respected in the community, and her advice and her guidance as well as her access to a lot of these other deaf communities is going to be extremely helpful in the creation of this show. On top of that, we're going to be working with Omar Padilla, who will be one of the clowns within the performance. He's been working with Prison Movement Theater as a clown for a very long time and is extremely talented in physicality. And then finally, we're going to be working with Jonah Gutierrez, our technical director, who also has a long-standing history working with special needs and special accessibility measures as an educator and teacher. Additionally, he'll be helping us with our technical measures as well. By the end of this project, we hope to welcome the deaf and hard of hearing communities to enjoy the rest of our work and gain a greater connection and knowledge to the needs of these communities so that we can continue to serve them in the future. We want to be able to provide services that will make these deaf communities feel welcome and feel happy to join us at future productions like Llama Pond. To our knowledge, there's never been a deaf and hard of hearing focused variety show in the Metroplex, much less in Texas. So this would be a major step forward in providing safe and accessible space for these communities and providing shows that are specifically catered for them.